Hi guys, Archie Luxury on the Poor Pluto channel. We're doing paid review 24 QA 26. This is for Chad. What wristwatch am I wearing today? Wristwatch check. I'm wearing my two tone bluesy, two tone bluesy, two tone bluesy, two tone bluesy. That's right, guys. That's what I am wearing today. That's what I'm wearing today, guys. Okie dokie. Let's start the review. Let's start the review. Let's actually, let's run the theme and let's start the review. Hi guys, it's Archie Luxury here. We're doing a paid review. Paid review. Paid review. And uh, let's get straight in there. Paid review. Paid review. Here we go. Here we go. This is for Chad. Now, Chad says, Hello, Archie. Looking for a good review of my collection. Started collecting at the beginning of last year and kind of went overboard quickly. I've attached a pic of my current collection. Right now, I'm on the list for a Patek Philippe Calatrava and a VC overseas. I'm really starting to get into dress watches lately. What would you thin out of to make room for different pieces? I'm sending you $100 for a good review. Let me know if you need the numbers. I, and I said, yes, of course I need the model numbers. Of course, I do need the model numbers. Um, so let, let's have a look and see what he's got. And let's let's discuss it in a bit of detail here. So starting, starting, we've got a Rolex Moonshine Gold Speedmaster 42 mil. Yes, sir. We got a Rolex Daytona, Daytona Rolex Daytona. That's the Paul Newman dial, reference 126518LN. We got a Tudor, sorry, no, we got an Amiga, Amiga Gold Amiga DeVille Treasel. I, I reckon that is something I would piss off. We've, next, we've got an Amiga Speedmaster Sapphire Sandwich, 42 mil. We got a Snoopy, a Snoopy, a Snoopy. Uh, we've got a an Aquaterra, Amiga Aquaterra, forty-one mil. A Tudor Black Bay, yes, forty. It's actually forty-one mils. We've got a Amiga Speedmaster Chronoscope. It's the Chronoscope. I'd probably piss the Chronoscope off. We've got an Oris. Aquaterra, nice blue. I'd still piss it off. We've got a Batman, Rolex Batman. Reference 126710BLNR. We got a Yachtmeister, Yachtmeister with the gray dial. Reference 126622. An Amiga Speedmaster 300. Oh, that's the white dial. Um. And he's got, is that a sub, what's that? That's a submarina, submarina date. Uh, now, his, his wife, his wife has got a date just, date just, Rolex date just two tone 31 mil, reference 278271. An Amiga Aquaterra 34 mils. Um, okay, so that's. I think what else is something else, but doesn't really matter. 
Um, okay, so so this is the collection. What do I think? Wowzers, Jesus. Now, I gotta tell you something, Chad. Slow the fuck down. Slow down. Slow down. We've got to be a bit careful here. Here we go. This is a nice shot here. So the men's stuff, what would I be doing? Let me tell you what I would be doing. Okay, for starters, what paddock Calatrava? Because there is no the Calic paddock Calatra paddocks are very beautiful. I don't know which paddock you're buying from the AD. You got you're on the wait list. Um most of the Calatravas can be had cheaper secondhand, but I suppose you don't really care. You just want, okay, fair enough, fair enough. I don't know which model. You haven't told me the reference number and the VC. The VC thing has, if that is actually over the overseas. They are going for below retail, unless it's a blue dial, when it's probably retail at best. So I would probably be saying, what the fuck are you doing ordering those two models? Because the market hype is over. It's fucking over, Chad. Wake the fuck up. Okay, wake the fuck up. Now, you've asked me some questions there. You said to me, what would I be getting rid of? Well, let, let's have a look and see exactly what we would be getting rid of in this collection here. Let's Let's have a good look because there are pieces I would be dumping if this was my collection. Uh, so let's 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 just have a look and let's see what we'd pump and dump. What would be dump? Okay, the Amiga Moonshine Gold. That's the first one. I'd actually I actually really like it. I'd keep that. The Daytona Paul Newman dial, beautiful. Keep that. The Amiga. Uh, gold, Deville, trees off. Fuck that off! So I would be fucking that off. I would be getting rid of that that trees are in gold. Fuck it off! Okay, that's what I would be doing. We've got the Amiga. Um, we've got the Sapphire sandwich. Keep that. The Snoopy. Uh, if you need the money, sell it. But it's okay to keep. The Aquaterra, I like it. I like it. That's okay. It's not a not, not a lot of money. The Aquaterra, the Tudor Black Bay Burgundy. Yes, I've got one myself. Love it. Love it. Love it. And we've got the we have got the Chronoscope. The Chronoscope. Um, I'd probably piss that off. That model's always been soft. Piss it off. Then we look down here. We've got the Oris. Now, i got to be totally honest with you. There's no reason you've got such beautiful things. Piss off the Oris. We don't need it. Don't need it. Get rid of the Oris. Again, it's not a lot of money, but I'd get rid of it. Clean up the decks. We've got the Batman. Batgirl. 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 The Jubilee Batman. Yes. Yes. I'd keep that. The Yachtmaster. Keep that. The Submariner. Keep that. And then the Amiga uh, C Master 300. Yeah, I like it. I like it with the white dial. I actually quite like that. So I would be pissing off. So to recap, piss off the Trezo. We don't fucking need that. That is just piss off the Chronoscope. Maybe the Snoopy if you need the funds. Piss off the Oris. And that's about it. That's about it. Okay, that's what I would be getting rid of. Those watches you've got on order, you didn't tell me which Patek you've got on order, but the Calatravas, most of them, I don't know what model. Is it a 6119? I don't know. I don't know. You didn't tell me the model number, but most of them, just be aware, it's not what it used to be. The market has fallen. And as for the VC, it's definitely fallen. So I'd possibly get out. I would keep the paddock on order, but cancel the VC. You don't fucking want it. Okay? You don't fucking want it. So, um, yeah, that's what I would, would do. I think a nice collection. I like it. Uh, nice Rolex. Nice Omega. Get rid of the Iris. Get rid of the Chrono Stop. Get rid of the Treat. You don't know, too much Omega. Um, but it is a 
beautiful collection. It is lovely. It is certainly a lot of money has gone into this collection. I think it is really, really nice. It's a nice collection. Now, we've got a few of your wives. Oh, here we go. Your wife's got a Amiga Constellation, two-tone. You've got the ladies' date just 31 mil, and you've got the – yeah, actually, that's quite nice. Those are very nice ladies' watches. Done. She's done. She's done. Believe you me, sex for life. You should get the works because you have really – Bought her an amazing collection. You haven't gone cheap with her. You have put the big bucks in. You put the big bucks in, honey. Honey should look after you. That's because you honestly, you spoiled her. So a beautiful collection. My advice to you is keep the Calatrava. Cancel the VC. You don't want the VC. Piss off the Amiga Trezor, piss off the Chronoscope, piss off the Oris, maybe the Snoopy, maybe the Snoopy to fund the paddock. I don't know what your finances are like, but beautiful collection, really nice. And um, yeah, what else can I say there? Really nice collection. So um, that's that's the point as I would, would go there. Guys, like, subscribe, and tell your friends. Remember, I can't survive on... Google ads alone, I depend on these paid reviews to survive, to survive, to survive. So that's the way it goes. So, guys, love it. Enjoy yourself. Love your watches. And remember, if you're buying or selling a watch in America, go to, go to David. Hi, guys. It's Archie Luxury. Guys, I want to talk to you about David SW. David SW, David SW. Guys, if you are in America, if you are looking for a Rolex watch of your dreams, in fact, if you're looking for a contemporary modern wristwatch, I strongly advise you to look at David SW. Guys, don't play the dealer games. Don't bring in chocolates or crispy creams for your dealer hoping to get a Rolex at retail. It's futile. Please, guys, save your dignity. Keep some pride. Go to David SW. I would highly recommend David SW, David SW. If you're in America and you're looking for a watch, go to David SW, David SW, David SW.